Have you ever wondered about the origins of the Banja dynasty? This intriguing lineage, with its roots deeply embedded in the northern and central regions of modern Odisha, predates even the mighty Gupta Empire. The story of the Banja dynasty begins with their succession of the Naga rulers of Padmavati. The early Banja rulers were chieftains who inherited the lands of Kendujar and western Odisha from the preceding Naga ruler, Satru Bhanja. The Banja lineage traced their origins to a mythical Pihen, a unique yet captivating aspect of their heritage. Initially, the Banjas ruled over mandalas under the Bhaumakara rule. Two prominent mandalas under their control were the Kinjali and Kijinga. The Kinjali mandala encompassed areas of Bud, Pulbani, Nayagar, Gumusar and Sonipur, with its capital at Dritipura. Meanwhile, the Kijinga mandala comprised Mayurbanj and Kendujar, with its capital at Kijinga Kota. The Banjas of Kinjali did not just rule, they also intermarried with the Bhaumakara dynasty, eventually gaining control over the Bhaumakara kingdom. However, the Kijinga Banjas experienced a decline with the rise of the Somavamshis, but they managed to regain their footing as feudatories of the Eastern Ganga dynasty. In the 3rd century, a prominent branch of the Banja dynasty, the Kanika Banjas, was established. They remained influential during the reigns of the Trikalingapati and Gajapati monarchs. Fast forward to the 12th century and we find the Panjas establishing the Keonjar state with the help of local Bhuyan clans. In the 14th century, a Banj prince named Anangadeva ruled Baud and by the late 15th century, the Daspala region was under the rule of Naran Banja. The Banjas were not just rulers but also patrons of culture. The Gumusar branch of the Banjas made significant contributions to Odia literature. However, their reign ended in 1835 when the British annexed the region. In a nutshell, the Banja dynasty, with its origins in northern and central regions of modern Odisha, succeeded the Naga rulers of Padmavati. They ruled over mandalas under the Paumakara rule, intermarried with the Baumakara dynasty, and eventually controlled the Baumakara kingdom. The Banjas established several branches, including the Kanika Banjas and the Gumusar branch, which contributed to Odia literature. Their reign ended with the annexation of the British in 1835. So, the next time someone mentions the Banja dynasty, you can impress them with your knowledge of their rich and varied history.